funny looking squid boy says to subscribe. Join my Discord and help me build my empire. Ah. Well, that was just a cinematic masterpiece right there. That's one goofy looking shoe. Not a fan of the name, but the stage looks cool. I'm probably speaking too soon, but the map actually looks kind of bigger than all the other new maps. However, it has like the exact same shape. I don't know why Nintendo's so obsessed with that weird shape. It's a pretty intimidating name. Also, look at this guy. What the heck am I looking at? How on earth did we make it down to Alterna to make a stage? This is what they call me when I do my daily uploads. Also, what the heck does this weapon even do? It just looks like a normal Splatling. The thing I always get the most excited for for Splatoon updates is always the music. It's just so cool. Literally half the reason why I like this goofy game is because of the music. I'm not even kidding. And it never disappoints me. I'ma stop you right there before you get too personal. I've been sick. Stay away. I mean, it's kind of cool for customization and everything, but what's gonna happen to the hats that are already backwards? They're gonna kind of lose their spark. There's some hats I chose just for the sake of them being backwards, and now those are just gonna be like, meh, because now there's cooler hats. Every single Salmon Run map looks the same to me. Also, these look cool, but as Omi said in her video, I'm never gonna be able to afford them. I already worked my butt off to get the green one. Um, I still haven't played table turf yet. Oh my gosh. I mean, all these new challenges look cool. Let's just hope their strict times fit my schedule. Don't worry, this will be like Grizzco where it's not full-time. They'll make it full-time in Splatoon 4 and make people happy about it, even though they should already have that in Splatoon 3. I take back anything bad I've ever said to Nintendo. There's a knitted bucket hat? I think I'm gonna have to go back to my old outfit and add in this new bucket hat. Dude, the OG Cherrell's comeback? Uh...